Hey everybody, welcome to the life of a board gamer. My name is Daniel. Today we are going to take a closer look what's in a box of a game called Pixie Queen. As you can see, it's still in shrink wrap. I did not open it because I want to share my experience with you when I open this box. So let's see what's inside. Okay, so let's open up the box and see what's inside. As you can see, I'm using scalpel, no more pinky knife. For some time, I lost it. I did not, this is just more convenient. And be sure to not cut yourself. Okay, so let's pry into this box and see what goods do we have in here. Okay, let's just throw that away. Okay, let's open it up, come on. Okay, we have a rule book that explain us how to play a game. And the game brewer does a good job because they bring you uh, rule books in so many languages that it's really really crazy there's french and german and this is netherlands i think and there's the english one because i understand english i will use this one and here are the overview of the components and how it the game plays well basically you are Pixies, fairies, or something like that, and uh, the queen, uh, you bring her your gifts and offerings, and she is pleased or not pleased with what you bring her, and in that way you get points. Oh wow, the back of the map even has some printing on it. It says Pixie Queen. Wow, I really like this. This is the, the sign of the great components and people do little things like this one. Okay, so here is the map. And it's pretty big map with, oh, really nice castle. So these are all the places you can go to and there is a scoring track over here, which uh, I really like for one specific reason. It has number on each place. You know, like they when they do uh, the thing uh, where they, there is one and then it's five, then it's ten, fifteen, and stuff like that. I really hate. I really hate things like that. I like when each each is number, each uh, space is numbered correctly. So really cool. Okay, uh, the board looks a bit dimmed down. It's 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 like, for example, when you look at the rule book, it all, it's all shiny, but over here it looks like more gritty, and I think it's to represent that queen can be very angry with offerings you bring to her. But overall, overall, it looks really really nice. It it's really clear of what is what, and I really like it. Okay, let's check out components. Components for these games are really cool. Okay, first of all, we have some cardboard components and as I can see, it's really nice thickness cardboard, really looking good. So there are some cardboard tokens and then we come to the main board. Oh, wow, wow, oh my God. I did not believe that these dice were so big. Wow, look at this. I mean, I have a big hand and look at this. This is really some chunky dice. Wow. Oh, they roll so good. If you already didn't know, I'm a big fan of dice. Any game that has dice in it, it's, it's like win for me. Okay, let's continue our unboxing video. Okay, so you get some extra, uh, you get some extra Ziploc bags for components and I applaud this kind of behavior in publishers. This is really awesome uh, because you can never have enough of this for a bunch of different components. Okay, let's first check these little things out then we'll go through these components. First of all, what we have is cloth bag. Oh, it's really nice, you can put your hand in. The people with big hands have problem with this kind of things in games. So, 
there's logo on it and it's I think heat transferred but it's okay it looks really nice so these are your shields that you will be hiding behind your resources okay first there is some stickers over here so you have to stick up some I think uh, cylinders over there that I see we'll take a look at it later and there is Firenze Index, I don't know, I don't, Pegasus, Klaus, E and E and Orien, Orien. Okay, so basically these are just player colors. So these are red, blue, green, brown, purple. Oh, and of course, on the back side, a quick summary of what is what you can turn into what and change and all that. Okay, so. Let's open and see what we have here. Okay, okay. We have some player components. So these are to mark probably to, to mark some things on the map. And it comes in five colors: red, blue, yellow, green, red. Red, I read that really sad, and, and there is this gray one. Wow, interesting, a gray color. You don't see gray color very often in games. And then, I don't need to open this, I can, but it's it's basically, it's, it's, it's really nice wood. Yeah, it's standard wood components. Really, really looking cool. Okay, then we have pixies or else or whatever it is oh they are really nicely shaped pixies let me just see if i can bring it a bit closer so you can check it so they have a wings and everything wow they really look cool really really looking nice really nice components love it love it love it and let's continue with this apples and you make applesauce no i don't know if you make applesauce but these are wooden apples is there any game with apples oh yeah there is there is there but there is no green apples in the game wow this looks pretty cool they look kind of nice not kind of but nice okay let's go okay so these are either bread or mushroom i would say it's a mushroom i don't think this is a bread let me just quickly go over the rules okay what do we have here so these are bread <laughs> okay so these are bread uh tokens and they they look cool as usual but i really thought those are mushrooms ah well I don't like mushrooms, but I like bread, so I think it's a win-win situation here. And then we have whatever this is. I think these are some potions or something like that. Quickly, let's quickly check it out. Honey pots. Okay, so these are the honey pots where you keep honey. Makes sense. And really, really nice wooden components. I really like production of this game. I, I think it's really well worth of your money. And then we have some black cubes, which are really big for a cube. Like for example, these are standard cubes that get you get in a game and you can see that these one are considerably bigger. And these are black one and there's also a silver not gray as you can see these are a bit silverish they have that glowy effect on them so they're not just gray cubes and you call them silver i like that i like that and these are some gold cubes wow these have really nice gold color it's like has a, a little bit of green tone to it I really like it. Oh my god, the components of this game are awesome. And of course, there's an 
that famous trench insert, but this one is pretty. This one even has a printing on it and stuff like that. Maybe there's something underneath. No, there is not. Okay. I thought maybe there is something in it. Wow, really cool. Okay, so that's what's come in a box of Pixie Queen. Okay, so that was unboxing of Pixie Queen by Game Brewer. And I must say, I really love the components of the game. The story is that uh, Queen is uh, a bit angry, as you can see. Let me just show it closer. She's kind of angry at you. And you give, you bring her offerings of bread and gold and honey pots and apples and whatnot. And she, she really likes or dislikes what you bring her. And in that way you earn points or you earn some negative points from her, which you really don't want to do. But the components, uh, I, I really like what Game Brewer does, and that is, uh, they, they make uh, games uh, friendly for all languages. You get like, you saw, you saw in the video, you get like five r different uh, rule books in each in different language, of course. And the game is completely uh, independent of the language, so you can play it... Uh, you basically you don't have you don't need to to hunt it down uh, like for me for example i always hunt down english copies of games because that's the only other language than my own that i understand so game brewer uh, i really like what they're doing they're trying to position themselves as a, as a company that makes games that are accessible to everyone and the components of these games are really really astonishing i really like those cubes that are not Go yellow and you call them gold they really have that gold shiny look to it the the the, the sculpted little pixies that are your player tokens i really like that it's not just blue token think of it as a pixie i like that in the games i really think this game is worth your money and really worth your time so check it out pixie queen by game brewer company and all of you other pixies that want to fling around and see what else I have to offer for you, you can check some other my videos right over there. And if you want to subscribe and don't miss some giveaways and other stuff I do, the subscribe button is right down there. Until next time, pozdrav!